Hi, I just want to show you how you could fix your headphone jack if you upgrade or you try to repair your headphone and something got wrong. I can just explain you what uh, in my case was the issue. Um, when I want to uh, put it back together, my right um, speaker of my headphones didn't work. So I searched for a solution and uh, then I found out how you, uh, where you see it here. On the picture, um, I cracked the, the flex PCB, and so I just soldered um, from this point here. You see it in uh, pink to the um, to the flex cable after the um, broken part. But you also could uh, just solder it directly to the middle pin of this um, IC there. So you see the, the video um, when I finished the fix and afterwards I tested it um, with the new battery I bought. It's a 3000 mAh battery. I think it's going to last me at least a week uh, of, no of normal listening time. And also I upgraded um, my uh, iPod Classic with the iFlash CF, uh, iFlash Quad um, micro adapter. I can just recommend uh, doing that. It's much faster. Um, it's a, it doesn't have any loading time, and you can um, add up to I think one gig, uh, one terabyte, or maybe two. Depends on how much money you want to spend on your SD card. So um, yeah, just solder this point uh, on top here, um, where I pointed it to. Um, to with a with a really small cable to the uh, middle pin of the IC or to the um, trace on the PCB and your um, headphone or your your speakers should be fixed or your output should be fixed. In my case, it fixed the problem. I'm not sure if you bro uh, you bro broke something else, but in my case, the PCB broke um, in the section, and I'm pretty sure that uh, if some of you, um, if you are really um, have an old PCB or something, it could still break or could bend and then break or something because it's really a really small connection. Yeah, thank you and have a nice time.